Hi everyone, this is Srinivas. Welcome to Amirpet Technologies. So in this video, I'm going to explain about uh, introduction to IO streams concept. Java IO streams. So first of all, let me explain what is a stream. Stream is a flow of data. Stream is a flow of data. It's a flow. Right? So from where you are reading the information or you can write the information. So I was streams, input output streams. Stream is a flow, flow of information. From where to where it will flow. Like from primary memory to a secondary memory or a secondary memory to primary memory like from memory, like RAM or something to hard disk, right? Hard disk to RAM, permanent places means file and all. See, Java supports different types of streams, different streams it will support, right? First, character streams, character streams. To read character type of data, and to write the character type of data, we are using the these streams, character streams we use. What are the two main classes we are using for this? One is a file reader. Second one is a file writer. One is for reading and one is for writing. Next one is a byte streams byte streams are there byte streams to work with a binary information the two main classes are file input stream class and file output stream class file output stream class to work with the byte streams Binary data means what? Like images, audio files, video files, anything we can write or read using the byte streams. The next important one is the object streams. What are object streams? The two important questions which will come in every interview is called serialization and deserialization. These two are nothing but writing object information into the file and reading object type information from the file the fourth one is a buffered streams buffered streams a group of bytes or group of characters at a time if you want to read or at a time if you want to write so then we can go with the buffered streams here two classes are there one is a object input stream, object input stream. Next one is a object output stream. All these are classes, object output stream. Buffered streams also, buffered reader, buffered writer, buffered reader class, buffered writer class. Two more classes are there. So to work with the different types of streams, not only these, the main, of course, not only these like array streams, array streams, console streams, data streams, other streams also supporting by the Java. See all these stream classes, IO stream classes belongs to a package called java.io package. So whenever we are working with all these, you need to import this java.io package like import java.io.star all at once or individually one by one, one by one we can import. See, a stream is nothing but a flow. Flow. Into the flow, right? You can write the information from the flow you can read the information also. So different types of streams, 
different types of streams right available in java to work with all these things simply we are importing the io package and corresponding stream classes we can use to perform all operations hope you understood please subscribe the channel thank you